Hello, Victor. Hi. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the TCK universe. We're here to tell you that we are about to make a video. I should probably put my phone on the charger. <laughs> so, uh... Let me sit first! So today, we are very lucky. Uh, we have a selection of 14 different sodas here, courtesy of the now-discovered Blue Sun sodas. Uh, we spoke to the manager, and I guess they're sort of sponsoring us, because we got these for free, we got these some shot glasses for free. free. We got uh, we got some bottle cap openers for free as well. And I discovered he didn't know how to use one, so you're going to get your experience today, buddy. Thank you. <laughs> uh, shout out to Blue, uh, Blue Sun Soda Shop in Minnesota, Spring Lake Park, as it says on this card. I want to leave the best for last. So what are you going to leave for last? I think you know. Oh dear God! <laughs> you choose first. What would you like to have first? All right. You know what I would like to try first? One of my favorite cereals of all time, ladies and gentlemen, the Whistler Classic Soda. The flavor is Fruity Pebbles. Yeah, you heard that right, Fruity Pebbles. This is probably gonna be really good. I'm gonna probably have more. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. No, yeah, no. Um, it's a twist off, dude. Ooh, it's bubbly. Yeah. Yeah. I wonder why. <laughs> Alright. I already want another. Yeah, right. Same. Oh my goodness. My guys. So good. They make these, uh, this, uh... In-house. Yeah, they make it all in-house. In we even saw, like, uh... The machine like, that they make it from. Yeah. It's actually, like, really cool. I want another. <laughs> actually, that was fucking good. Yeah, dude. Uh, it does taste like Fruity Pebble, so it's really good. That is, like, accurate to Fruity Pebble, like... Yeah. Alright, well, TZ... Oh, jeez. Yeah. You've never tried one of these before. I haven't. This actually looks like... See, when I first saw this bottle, I was like, what the fuck kind of alien creature is that? I can't get to my drink. There is a tiny ball. Fingers too fast. There, there we are. are. All right. Take a drink. Oh, that's fucking cool. So the ball rests right there. It's matcha flavor. That is weird. Oh, I might not like this. I already, I already do not like this. Let's try it. All right. I was expecting it to be worse, I will be quite honest. Yeah, it's, it's pretty good. It's not what I was expecting, because last time I tried one of these, it was the cucumber flavor. Mm -hmm. I think you really would have liked the cucumber flavor. Why didn't we get the cucumber? I'm going to be honest with you. <laughs> I thought this was a cucumber at first, and then when it was in the box, it was matcha, and I was like, oh. <laughs> and I was just like, you know what, screw it. So, uh, <laughs> I'll put this on your side. That's a win for you. Okay. I, I'm not a fan. I want that green beverage right there. This green magical beverage. Oh, what flavor is this magical green beverage you may ask? I think it's apple. I think it's lime. Nope, it's orange. We're not shitting you, it's orange. <laughs> We're sponsored by the soda place. We're not shitting you. <laughs> They're probably gonna be like, we will never do another sponsor deal with you again. You opened it this okay, time. It's a twist off. Take that, okay, well listen, we, we we were sponsored to use these bottle cap openers, and we're not even using them! Thumbs up. Alright, this is, uh, orange. I know, right? <laughs> oh my god, that is orange. It is orange, it's just like, it's like not tart. Yeah. It's got a, like, strong orange flavor, but it's not like, it's not like Fanta or Sunkist. Fanta? Fanta, Fanta, whatever. Okay. My choice. Please, select. Alright, so my next choice is... this. Oh! What is that? Do you want to know what it is, TZ? I, I already know what it is, but... <laughs> <laughs> it's right in front of me! <laughs> what do you guys think it is? That's right, it's baby piss! <laughs> like, this looks like cream soda, actually. It's probably gonna be a lot, a lot, a lot like cream soda, to be honest. Hey, oh wow, that actually does, smell it, smell it. Whoa, Whoa that really smells good. It's like you smell the salt. Like I smell everything, like I smell the kettle, I, sm I smell the kettle you corn. You smell the salt. It's weird. It's so good. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Oh my god. That was actually really good. Well, everybody, uh, I I gotta choose my next soda, right? Yeah. Well, today's <laughs> video, <laughs> yeah. today's video was also was not sponsored 
by today's Bendy Box. Bendy Box has given us a soda in here. So many treasures. What, what's what's in today's Bendy Box, shall we? Sure thing. Alright, here we go. Mouse. It's... That's right, folks, it's Swamp Juice. <laughs> so... Thanks, Bendy Box. Swamp Juice, uh, let's say... Uh, I don't want to tell the flavor right yet. Uh, let's see. Avery's? So it's a brand. And they make multiple monster flavor drinks based on various... Monster flavor drinks? There's one that called Cat Piddle in there. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's just basically gross flavors, but they're like... It's called yeah, it's, Totally Gross Soda. And they're like everyday drinks. They're like cream sodas. It's whatever. But this Swamp Juice is every flavor that they have in this bottle. So I'm expecting this one to be a mess. <laughs> It's gonna be a mess, it's gonna be a lot. but it's gonna be a good mess. What the fuck? There. First try. <laughs> Cut the other parts out. Give it to me, Daddy. As I was saying that, I'm like, why am I saying this? <laughs> you're like in the process of saying it, you're like, what am I even saying right now? <laughs> they're sponsoring this video, and they're, they're gonna see you say the words, give it to me, Swamp Daddy. <laughs> they're gonna be like, yep, never again. Ne why Why did we even consider this in the first place? Alright, here we go. I smell? Oh, there's a smell. Oh, that's pretty nice. Yeah, actually. Okay. It doesn't have a flavor to it. There's a lot going on, but it's very subtle. So it's like they added the tiniest bit of flavor from everything in this drink. Yeah, they didn't overload it with flavor, so that way yeah. it's like, it's you'd, tasteable. You'd, you'd expect it to be everything, but... It's like, yeah, it's every flavor, but it's not like... It's not too much uh, concentrate. No. I don't know why we're calling these a win. No, I, I like the concept, so we're sticking with it. I'm choosing now. Bendy Box chose the last one, yeah. so... <laughs> Wait, no, no, Bendy Box shows Swamp Juice. It's your turn. All right, so there's a new world-famous YouTuber today. His name is Jack Black. What? Andrea from the soda shop explained to us that Jack Black actually has a soda line. And this is... Actually his? Yeah, this is his soda. Uh, and it's Scarecrow Berry Soda. This is... Scary buttery strawberry jam soda. Jack Black, what the fuck were you thinking? <laughs> uh, I'm actually expecting this to be pretty good. A little like out there, but kind of good. Let's do it. <laughs> do you want me to keep that in? I don't know. <laughs> Ooh. This is a lot. Yeah. I can tell. All right. Yep. Oh. <laughs> there is. That is thick. That's kind of a lot in there. It does. It's like... Oh. It's kind of like got a bit of sourness to it. I like sour. It's, it's very, uh... There's a lot of flavor in there. <laughs> you do the honors. I definitely know. Alright, so this is a, a birch beer. So it's kind of like root beer in a way. It's how they used to make root beers when I heard. But like, uh, 30 Lab Rats got tested, uh, apparently, and it was like... Describe this. Basically, the was it had something to do, not necessarily law, but like rumor that birch beer was bad for you. Yes, that's now, what I was hearing. Uh, I forget the ingredient, but now it's made with like an artificial ingredient. It, it's an artificial ingredient, but it's still got like the same like go to to it. So so it's like root beer, but like the original root beer. From what Andrea told us, she said. Once we have this and go back to regular root beer, we are going to taste quite the difference. That's a winner for both of us. Yeah, that is definitely a winner for us both. I would highly recommend. If you ever come across birch beer, please get it. Yeah. We still have seven sodas to go. I know. We have so much to go through. What back, is that? Backcountry blueberry lemon soda. What? Here's yours. Thank you, sir. Thank, Thank you, kind you, sir. Oh. Bizarre. This, like, doesn't taste... It, it doesn't smell fruity at all. It doesn't smell good. This tastes. This smells. I'm nail polish. Not the artificial smell of nail polish. It's just kind of got the same vibe to me. Yeah. All right. Ready? I, I'm done sniffing this thing. Let's just fucking drink it. Okay. 
Three, two, one. It tastes better than it smells. This is a winner for you. Think so? Yeah, not my thing. All right, there you go. We have peaches and cream. Ooh, I'm excited for this one. Also the same like um, brand as the... Uh... This was made in-house. Yeah. There we go. You watch peaches and cream absolutely just destroy us and we start crying for some reason. <laughs> Why are you crying for? You don't know! <laughs> right. All right, ready to go. Oh, that was... That was a lot of sugar in that. Do you like it or is it too much for you? I need a second one to decide. Do it. I liked it. I liked it. So right now it's in the win category on my side of the field, but... Yeah, we just got a bunch of things that you like. I hate we, we did Babs Old Fashioned Root Beer. I've heard good things about this. You have? Yeah. Apparently it's just a good root beer. Hey! We just had Birch Beer. Yeah. Shut up. Right. Well, this just be a win for both of us, so we're going to put Birch Beer and Root Beer right next to each might, other. Might be interesting to like kind of do a taste back of Birch Beer after this one. Definitely. Mm. Oh, no. Actually, no, that's good. The aftertaste is incredible. Aftertaste is good, man. Yeah, the first first taste is good. Initial test taste. N the initial taste is just like, oh, what the f***? A doodle. And then you like get into it and you're like, oh, I don't know. That's actually pretty good. So I'm just going to pop it right here. Let's separate this from Jack Black's <laughs> over there. Jack Black, you stop. Stay, <laughs> stay away from the good guys. <laughs> So I'm gonna grab this one. All right, so this one's very special to me. I can you know what, you can explain this one because this is special to you more. Yeah, you, you really don't know. I have no I have no clue about anything, so please. So there's a show out there, and it's called Firefly. And it was canceled, but it was a really good show. It didn't go on that long, but it has a very strong cult following. It also got a movie called Serenity. Uh, that's actually what this store, uh, Blue Sun Sodas, they named that after something in Firefly. I forget why. Yes. I didn't know that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And this is called Serenity Soda. So this is lime and coconut flavored. You put the lime in the coconut, you drink it all up. Clink. Yep. All right. We smell good. I love that. Yeah. Right. I absolutely love that. I, That's okay. For both of us. You know what? The coconut, the coconut totally... Actually, no. The lime and the coconut are both there in equal force. And coconut, to me, doesn't sound like something you expect in a, in a pop. I get that a lot with uh, sparkling water, lime and coconut. Yeah. Like the ice brand. But that, <laughs> oh my goodness, was incredible. So this is a cola. Okay. We haven't really done any colas here. But this is a cure-all cola, as they call it. Okay. It's basically a very raspberry. Oh, that's right. She said that. Yeah, Andrea said that was raspberry. Yep. All right. Smell. Ooh. Yeah, it's got. It's got. It's pretty potent. I just taste the raspberry immediately. Mmm. That's sugary. It's very sugary. I'm not sure it's my thing, but I don't hate it. It's kind of weird. Would you Would you put it the both like, or do you need another taste? I need another taste. I'm picky, by the way. He is very picky. <laughs> like, if you can't see... <laughs> I've seen this boy go to fucking... Go to fucking Golden Corral. Go to fucking KFC. And try both their mac and cheese. And actually judge them to, like, critique. Like he was Gordon Ramsay or something. Look. <laughs> so where would you put this? I'll put it in the center. I didn't need it. You, you, okay. Uh, perfect. <laughs> you know what I like the most about this situation? What? We have more in the middle... Than we do on either of our sides. Yeah, and that's good. That's good. It means we picked out the right kinds. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? So we've got the two worst options left, right? And it's your choice. <laughs> I know which one you wanted to do, la like, way last. It's up to you. I do not care. The blue is not on screen. <laughs> Let's just get it out of the fucking way. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, I may I present to you, in the comment section, what do you possibly think this flavor is? Blue raspberry? Cotton candy? Man, I fucking wish. It's blue cheese. <laughs> so you're probably thinking, wow, there's not that much soda in here. Why is that? And that's because right after we bought this, we drove 
Well, you drove, and I thank you for that. You're welcome. All the way to the mall where Noah works. Also where I work. <laughs> I love you to throw that in there. <laughs> and, uh, and we made him try it without checking the label. And he thought it was disgusting. And then we went down to my work, and I also made him try it. And that was funny. I'm not smelling this. Uh, you're not smelling it? You're you already smelled We already smelled it. Okay, so we both gotta go for it. Alright. To, uh, to Andrea. <laughs> Thanks, Andrea. Okay. I hate this. I've never, like, I understand, like, drinking as a coping mechanism for some people. That wasn't coping, motherfucker. Oh, God, I have anxiety. <laughs> Seconds? No. <laughs> <laughs> May I present to you the last one? Banana. Wait. Why did I say this was one of the worst ones? Well, our good friend over at Blue Soda, sh Blue Soda, S Blue Sun Soda, I am so bad. Andrea. <laughs> <laughs> Our good friend at Blue Sun Soda, Andrea, told us that this banana, this particular banana, tastes like circus peanuts. I, I, I wish I was joking. I'm actually expecting it to be kind of good. Well. <laughs> well. All right, here we go. Ready? Smell? Oh, that smells so good. <laughs> told you. I was expecting it to be good. All right, ready? All right, ready? Three, two, one, go. Is, yeah, actually, that's really good. Andrea. I, I freaking love it. Andrea, did you pick the right one? <laughs> because this was actually really good. Yeah, I, I really like going more. Yeah, go. Frick yeah. While you grab more, Bendy Box has come in with another delivery. Okay. What did Bendy Box send us this time? Uh, sent us... <sighs> okay, let's see here. Brainwash, carbonated drink, for a change of mind. I have no idea what flavor this is. Let me, let me read it. Good luck. <laughs> okay. It's open. I already know what this tastes like. So, do you want more? No. <laughs> it's all on me, I guess. You ready, my friend? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. Alright. <laughs> <coughs> That's how I felt. I don't like this video. I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Bendy box, what the fuck? <laughs> Birch beer, really, was my favorite. Uh, let, me, let me choose my favorite here. Um, I like birch beer and Serenity soda, lime and coconut. That was insanely good, but okay, you know I have to stick with the. I have to stick with birch beer on today's episode. I'm a little stuck between Swamp Juice and Serenity soda. Hold on, let me take another sip of uh, kettle corn here, really quickly. Actually, wait. Fruity Pebbles. Fruity Pebbles was good. Why isn't it in the middle? I don't know. Well, it's in the middle now. Okay. I guess we didn't decide the whole middle factor until after the orange green. Yeah, the Fruity Pebbles one is. Just it was delicious. bomb. Mm. Isn't it good? Hold on, I'm grabbing some. It's like more. a warm hug from mom. <laughs> <laughs> I could get up in the morning, have a sip of this, and feel like I just had breakfast. Honestly, I'm gonna try that tomorrow. I'm not drinking soda for a while now. Uh, I already don't drink that much soda. This is already enough for you, wasn't it? <laughs> uh, I think you were at the enough point when we got to the third soda, and you're like, I'm good. This was interesting, because it's like, I was confident about this one, and you weren't. And like, I was listening to Andrea. I like it. I like it. Alright, there you go. I'm just gonna down it. Go. 
Oh, God. There's something in the back of my throat now. I think it's the fucking brainwash coming back and bite me. <laughs> I want to say thank you guys so much for tuning in this video. If you enjoyed, be sure to hit the like button. There is something bothering the back of my throat. Do the rest of this outro. <laughs> All right. Uh, thank you guys for watching. And if you, if you support TZ, come check out my stuff. I do a lot of, like, music. Um, Rick McKnight. And then I do a lot of uh, gaming uh, over my channel, Epicade. Uh, but, <laughs> if you didn't like me, and, <laughs> that's a weird way to phrase it, if you know who I am and you don't know who TZ is, go check him out on his channel. He does a lot of gaming, uh, but in, in different formats than, than I do. He does more live stream stuff. No, you know you do live streams, I do more of like funny moments. I don't do outros. <laughs> but, uh, He's the live stream, yeah. he does more live streams than I, I do live streams, but you do more live streams than I do. I do actual videos. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you like this video, please please tell us you want more because we're probably going to do this again with more Saros. Honestly, yes. Yeah. This was really good. And Brainwatch. <sighs> Brainwatch was bad. That was bad. I figured out what was in my throat. What? I don't know. <laughs> but it was something back there. If you guys enjoyed, be sure to like button. If you're not subscribed, be sure to the subscribe button today. Uh, subscribe, and, uh, subscribe to Victor McKnight over on his YouTube channel. He makes music. He also does live streams over on Epic with his friend Alan and Noah's also on there. You're on the channel too, man. Well, oh, yeah. Recently, I just got added onto the channel, but... Mm. Oh, I want to I pass a very special thanks to Andrea. Uh, when we approached her, and she was very welcoming. So, once again, uh, Andrea, thank you for the opportunity. And go check out uh, Blue, Sun, Blue Sun Soda Shop. If you live in the state of Minnesota, be sure be sure to check this place out. I I went there when they first opened up, like when they were first opening. Like I just graduated college. Over a thousand flavors, by the way. That is a lot of flavors. Uh, I'm gonna I, I'm gonna end this video off with um. <laughs> Slap me. <laughs> Selection.